Merkel s. security threat Germany at risk of t.terror raid. Tack unless borders tightened. August Hanning, who ran Germany's Federal Intelligence Service, BND, from 1998 2005, has warned the country will face a significant security threat as long as we let people come into the country without identity papers. Mr. Hanning told German newspaper Bild am Sonntag, as the terrorist attacks and attempted attacks in the last two years have shown, the security situation in Germany is very tense. Our security architecture needs to be urgently improved in order to meet new challenges. Otherwise it threatens to become very uncomfortable for us in Germany. Mr. Hanning also criticized Angela Merkel's refugee policy, claiming an undeniable link between internal security and efficient border control. He said Germany had learned its lessons from the case of 2016 Berlin attacker Anna Zemry, who was already known to German authorities before he drove a lorry into pedestrians browsing a Christmas market. However he considers it negligent for Germany to allow refugees in without stronger identity controls. Mr. Hanning said, I believe everyone involved learned from that case, and things have improved a great deal. But as long as we let people come into the country without identity papers, without clear identity controls, we will have a big security problem. Germany's world-famous Christmas market saw a raft of ramped-up security measures in 2017, including armed police patrols and concrete barriers at pedestrian entrances. This move was intended to prevent terrorists carrying out a copycat attack after Tunisian migrant Anna Zemri's truck attack killed 12 festive revelers at a market on Berlin's main shopping street. Meanwhile New Year's Eve organizers in central Berlin introduced women-only safe zones at celebrations. Run by the German Red Cross, the zones were introduced to prevent a repeat of the spate on sexual assaults on women revelers at New Year celebrations in Cologne in 2015-16. A leaked police report revealed more than 1,200 women were sexually assaulted across Germany on that New Year's Eve, while over 2,000 men were thought to be involved in the crimes. Most of the suspects were recent arrivals in Germany. As well as the women's zones, police introduced a raft of security measures for New Year's in Berlin, banning large bags, rucksacks, suitcases, glass bottles and alcoholic drinks from the site. There were hundreds of security personnel at the event, as well as 1,600 additional police officers stationed throughout the city.